fear of going into a nursing home or a retirement home and losing all their money that they've saved all of their lives to be able to pass on to their family and friends. Hi, Les from Retired and Living the Dream. And as it says on the thumbnail, I'm going into an assisted living accommodation. So why am I doing this? I'm doing this for research purposes because I've had plenty of people asking me about retirement homes and nursing homes and assisted living in Thailand. But I'm not just going to do a video for one day and have a quick look at it. I'm actually going to live in the, the assisted home for three nights, four days, and I'll talk to the owners and I'll actually talk to the people who are living in assisted home location. And I'm not going to tell you where the location is until after I've done the review on the video and that will be next week. So I'm going down this weekend for three, three nights, four days, and I'm going to do a full outlook on it. The costs, what's included with the um, packages, many, many, many things I'll cover on this video because it's important because I've had quite a few people who, who ask me. Why am I doing this video? Because as we're all getting older in our retirement age, sometimes we need extra help and extra care available. And sometimes this comes at a huge cost, such as like the UK. On average, in the UK, I'll refer to my notes here because I've been doing some research and it's wow, opened my eyes up in comparison to what you can get here. And I'll show this and I'll prove this next week. Uh, the average cost for a care home is between 27 and 39,000 pounds per year and can greatly increase to 35 to 55,000 pounds a year if care is required. Now looking on the internet for, for looking for prices for nursing homes and things like that, obviously it, it's, a, it's like a minefield. There's prices, the better locations, the better care, you get, everything has a cost value towards it. So, but on average, the average cost of a, a care home is £760 per week. And then going into a, a nursing home can be £960 per week. So, massive cost difference. And then if you have assets over £23,500 in the UK, you're responsible for paying all costs for a nursing and care home. So, that can eat into your retirement fund and also eat into the, any profits that you've got in your house that you're hopefully going to pass over to your kids and things like that. And if you actually give some of this property away to get you below the £23,500 and the government deem that you've done this to avoid getting extra help for nursing care, then you won't get it either. So in re reality, getting old is very, very costly. So I want to be able to offer an alternative and this alternative is where I'm going to go stay this weekend. It's in a lovely location and you'll see by the video next week that it's absolutely beautiful. Have you got any questions that you want to know? I've got a list of questions I'm going to ask myself, but if you're watching this video and you've got this far through, there's obviously some questions that you want to know also. So put some questions on the comments down below and I'll ask them questions on your behalf so we come up with a massive picture of hopefully everything that everybody wants to be able to cover. But getting old doesn't have to be a lonely experience. It doesn't have to be a costly experience. There are alternatives if you look outside of the box. You can actually hang on to your property and things like that because there's solutions for everything. And I can come up with quite a few solutions for those people who have fear of going into a nursing home or a retirement home and losing all their money that they've saved all of their lives to be able to pass on to their family and friends when they curl their toes up. So put some comments down below and I'm going to have a, a good weekend this weekend. I'm sure, I'm sure of it. My wife laughed when I told her that we're going to an assisted, <laughs> assisted living home for three nights, four days. But I'm looking forward to it. How many people can say that they're looking forward to going to an assisted living home? I can say I'm looking forward to it because I'm looking forward to the adventure and looking forward to being able to find out some of the answers that some of you will have, obviously, about living in assisted care homes. But reading the literature before I go, there are some big solutions that will save you absolutely hundreds of thousands of pounds over the time that you need maybe it's assisted living uh, care or comfort. So give me a thumbs up if you like it. Give it a thumbs down if you don't like it. Leave the comments down below. 
So, looking forward to the weekend. Bye for now.